Hello everyone, welcome to Learning X. In this video, I have come with a new sales dashboard using Microsoft Excel. The dashboard is very simple and focused on target versus actual sales analysis. I will cover the dashboard in two parts. In the first part, I will show this donut chart showing target versus actual sales with this nice map design. And in the second part, I will show this yearly comparison chart and rest of the analysis. So let's start. First of all, look at the dashboard that what we'll make. We'll design this map and show actual versus target sales in this with the help of donor chart for every single province. Then we'll make this yearly trend analysis. Here the red and green mixed line is the sales trend of the selected region. And black dotted is the average sales of all region. Green is indicating higher sales, whereas red is indicating lower sales. Change the province, it will show that province trend. After that, we will find out total sales, max sales, lowest sales, and the province which have achieved sales target of this respective month. So, we will begin now with the target versus actual donor chart. Go to sales page, copy this province name and paste it here. Give two headings, sales and target. In the meantime, copy this month name and paste it as transpose here. Go to developer, insert and select this. Then right click here, go to format control for input range. Select this cell containing month data. It will be our query list. And for cell link, select this cell. Click OK. Now, if we change the month name, it will give a number counting the position of that month from the below range. Like for January, it's 1. We'll give the same number in the sales data. Here, we'll give 1 and we'll continue it till 12. We'll also copy it to sales target data. So now 1 will indicate January, 2 will indicate February and so on. Now we'll use index and match formula to derive the data from the sales data for selected month. I'll type index. I'll select this data of all month as array. Lock it, I'll type match. Select this province as match value and for lookup array of that province, I'll select this. Match type 0. For column number, we'll use match again. Select this one as lookup value, lock it. Select this as array, lock it, mess type 0, bracket close. Now drag it. Now we have to do the same for target. We'll use same formula and method, just we'll select this target data. Index select this as array, lock it, match, select this as lookup value, select this as array, lock it, again match, select this as lookup value, And this is as array, lock both, bracket. So now we will add another column. How much target have we met? Select this, divide this cell, form it to percent. 
then rest percent will be 100 percent minus this achieved percent but here are some minus data so we will use if formula here if this cell is less than 0 percent then give 0 percent if false then this cell done now create a new sheet rename it to dashboard now i'll insert a map for my dashboard already i have prepared it in powerpoint i'll copy this map and i'll paste it in this dashboard sheet now i'll create target versus actual donor chart for every province of this map go to insert select this donor chart right click select data add a series give this province as name and select this as chart data remove title region etc give no fill and no outline to the chart Change the series color you like. Increase the donut hole size. Select this achieve series with blue color. Give a border. Give a border width to 7.25. Give a shadow effect. Now copy and paste it to the dashboard near the related province. Now go to analysis and select this series and change the data source. Just drag it down to one cell. Then do the same formatting that we have done earlier. Then I will continue this to all the province. Then copy this drop down and paste it to dashboard. Link the cell link and input range once more. Now it will be interactive. Now go to insert and bring a line. Change the color, weight. And dash type. Copy and paste it to indicate all the charts. Then insert a shape for data, connect it with the chart data, and format that. Copy this shape and paste it in all the province. Then connect data of that province with the chart.
then change the chart angle insert another shape on text box link it with the province name copy and paste it to all the charts and connect it to the province Then copy the shapes and this time connect with the cells. Format the cells first to show it in million. Go to format, cell and in custom type, type 0 and M in quotation. Now connect with the cells, do the same for all charts. Now insert a round shape, give no outline, give maximum glow effect, change glow color to blue, now copy and paste it to all the province. Give a title. That's all for this part. Check out the next part to watch the full tutorial where I'll show regional trend analysis and other parts of the dashboard. I hope you have enjoyed the video and if you have enjoyed the video then don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.